Hi, everybody. I'm going to do a little bloom on this tile. Modified bloom. With some pretty colors that I came up with. Try not to put so much color in the middle so that I don't lose half of it off the side. All right. got some Amethyst by Josanya. Nightfall, little, this little piggy. Windsor and Violet. Windsor Violet by Windsor and Newton. And gold. This is um, 24 karat gold and some deep gold. mixed together. Amsterdam deep gold. And yellow. Amsterdam uh, medium transparent yellow. So let's see what I'm going to put down first. This nightfall feels a little thick, so I'm just going to add a little bit of water. some of this down first. And then I'll put the dark purple on top. again. I think I'll put the nightfall on top. out a black cell activator. Shoot. I'm going to make some more. Should be enough for this. I think I should 
should have put weight in there too. Usually I put weight underneath. I wonder how it would be with the weight on top. Oh, live dangerously, Carol. If you don't try, you'll never know. Wow, that surely is different. Holy, holy Hannah. Usually I do white under the black. This time I did it reverse. Let's see what happens. Let this settle back in. That looks really pretty though. And I want to do some, uh, some little wooden Christmas ornaments that I got. So I might try that color, would look nice with some gold. Some pretty cells there. I'll zoom you in. The middle's coming back. It's stuck right there. I want to wait for a bit. I love this color combination. Wow. One, two, three different colors of purple and gold. And yellow underneath the gold just doesn't look so bright, but it help it makes the gold look lighter. So it's you can see a little yellow there. It's actually got some green tinge to it because I think my pouring medium had some turquoise in it. So it kind of came out with, with a nice yellow green, which I like. So it's not a big deal. Still looks really good. See if we can move it now. Try and jiggle it loose. Just want to make sure this is centered. Okay, I'm going to give it a spin. Go the other way. A 
That's looking pretty awesome. Wow, that 24 karat gold is just dazzling. Just dazzling. Anybody that's going to try this bloom technique, you got to do other pours first if you're just a beginner because it's not the easiest technique to do first. Try other techniques. Flip cups, swipes, dirty pours, straight pours, just to get the feel of your paints and everything. Watch lots of videos. I have over a hundred, actually I have nine over a thousand videos. I've been doing this a while. I'm just gonna add a little paint to the corner just to help it get off a little more. All my recipes are in the description below the video. If you want to do other techniques other than the bloom, you can use um, Floetrol in your mixture. And another spin. this I think I don't think I want to spin it anymore look at that that's so pretty I'm liking this uh, gold mixed in with the col one color combination there look at that isn't that pretty whoops you really got a close up I'll let you in a little bit there. Okay. Thanks for watching and have a great day. And uh, come back to my art room. And subscribe if you haven't subscribed already. Hit the bell. Comment below. All that good stuff. See you in my next video. And I'll put the dried result of this right at the end. Bye. Hi, everybody. Here's my dried six by six tile. Look at that. Dried really smooth. No bumps or lumps. No cracks. Look at those pretty cells. Look at that. Love that spot right there. And right here. Look at that. Dried awesome. Thanks for watching. Have a good day. Bye-bye.